Take the risk or lose the chance. Have faith in yourself. Take that risk. One step at a time, you will win. Earn your respect with proving them wrong. You have the power to change your future. Be the person you wanted to become. If we keep doing what we're doing, we're going to keep getting what we're getting. The time is now. What are you waiting for? An opening? Here's one right now. Create one this very minute. Listen to yourself. Listen to what you need. You need to take a risk now. Don't wait one more second, one more moment for the hand on your clock to go past the 12 one more time. It's not worth it. Living the same routine. Look at yourself in the mirror like every other day. Sit on the train on the same seats every day. Do you really want that? Do you really want to wake up tomorrow bored of your life again? Tomorrow, wake up and do that thing you've always wanted to do. Take that risk you never wanted to change. Don't let anyone hold you back. Wait. Work. Win. Imagine yourself 10 years from now. What do you picture? Take a second to think about that. Something negative, positive, do you really see this picture coming true? Change your mindset from negative to positive. You need to believe that the picture will be real. Believe that it is real. Because your future is your reality. You need to change now to make this picture happen. And you need to believe that it's going to happen. No one else can make this change. Don't rely on anyone else but yourself. Trust yourself. Trust yourself that this will happen, that this change will emerge. Wait, work, win. Take the risk or lose the chance. There might be an opportunity right now. There might be something you want to start or take the plunge on. But you are scared of the what if. You are scared of failing, so you don't take the chance to find out if it was part of your success story. You want change, but you don't want it as much as you want to stay the same. You might think you want it. You might think it is your passion. But if you're not willing to risk the life you have right now to reach the one you want, you don't want it as much as you thought. The choices you make now will affect your future and change your life completely. The time is now to make the changes you need to alter your life forever. The right choice is around the corner. You need to feel the desire to change in order for it to happen. You need to crave the opportunity to alter yourself. You have the power to change your future. You have the power to improve your future. Your mindset needs to change, positive. Then your life can change, positive. Then your future can officially change for the better, positive. Finally, you deserve this change. You need to change. Wait, work, win. Earn your respect, stop expecting it. People automatically think they deserve respect but nobody owes you anything. You are not owed respect. You let your ego get in the way when you expect respect. Go into a situation with no expectations. Earning respect is a hard thing because you may work so hard that you deserve respect, but you may still not receive it. It is progress, not perfection, that you are striving for. One step at a time, you will win. Perfection is not sustainable. Perfection will destroy you. Perfection will turn you into the mad scientist. Perfection will make you lose your mind. But progress, progress is what you need. Progress little by little every day. That will lead to success. Progress will make you consistent. Progress will keep you on track. You are the company you keep. You will become the friends you hang around with. Ask yourself, am I bettering myself each day? 
You may think you can change their ways, but you will become what the majority of the group is. If you are unable to do this every day, you will never be successful. If you hang around with a group of dozers and lazy people, that is who you will become. You will become lazy. It is the small wins every day that add up to the big wins at the end of the year. If you expect to change the lives of multiple people and yours too, you're mistaken. Trust me when I say changing your own life is hard enough. What makes you think you can help other people before you have even helped yourself? It is step by step that we climb the mountain. We forget that it was one step at a time. When you hang around with people who hustle, you either get to the same page they're on, or they will drop you as a friend. We get so caught up in trying to get to the top that the peak of the mountain can freeze us into fear. So scared of the journey ahead that we don't even get started. You will compete with each other in a healthy way. If he wakes up at 6 a.m., I'm walking at 5 a.m. If he goes to the gym, I'm coming too. When they work hard, you work harder. And when they see you work hard, they work even harder. When your goal is so big and wild, fear can freeze you too. You see, completion. I always say to people who have great self-belief, imagine what you are capable of. Imagine if everything you can achieve. No, imagine if there were five of you working on the same goal. When the day is over, am I better at what I do? Have I learned more about my passion? Do I understand what I want that little bit more? Work with no expectations. The most important person you must gain respect from is yourself. Self-respect. When you value yourself, you will seek the respect of others less and less. You will require compliments less and less. Don't limit your challenges. Challenge your limits. You need to have substance. You need to have something about you that shows you are hardworking, that shows you are disciplined, that shows that you follow your word. You must follow through. We stand in the way of ourselves, full of doubt, not wanting to take a leap of faith. If you say you are walking at 5 a.m., continue to do that day in and day out. If you say you train harder than everyone else, you need to show that is the case every single day. Have faith that things will get better. Don't take the challenges as setbacks. Don't take a step back. Take the next step forward, a step forward into success. Surround yourself with people willing for you thrive, change, and grow. Have faith in yourself. Take that risk. Open the opportunity for yourself. Who said you couldn't? Make your life interesting. Change the way you see yourself. Change the way you see the way you live your life. How about now? Are you scared? Don't be. Open your door to more opportunities. Now's the time. Don't waste it. Not today. Stand face to face with your fears. Time won't wait for you. Only you can take this risk. If you don't change, neither will the rewards. If you're not willing to change, don't expect everything around you to. So now's the time. You want things to change? Change them. So grasp the chance. Now, don't let this chance slip away. Don't stand in your own way. Embrace your challenges. Use them as lessons. Lessons to inspire you. Improve yourself. Take each one as a step closer. A step closer to recovering yourself in order to finally take care of yourself. If you are still striving to be better, then together you are more likely to achieve that goal. Transform yourself. Phase into the next chapter of your life. The chapter where you can become stronger. The chapter where you can become powerful. The chapter where you challenge your limits. That chapter is soon. Trust yourself. Trust the journey you're on and take that risk. 
The sad thing is that if you're in a bad friendship group hanging around with people who do not want better for themselves, then you need to leave those people behind. You are carrying dead weight. I have learned over the years that if they don't want better for themselves, they most likely don't want better for you. They may say that they do, but if you were progressing forward and bettering yourself, then they would be losing a friend because you are in a different place. This is why sometimes your best friends hate on you. This is why they say sly remarks or sneer at your dreams. Take the risk today. Take the risk that no one else is willing to take. Be the person to stand out. Stand up for yourself. The choice you make now, this very moment can alter the way you live, how your path will be drawn, and the future you will be given. Don't let your self-doubt and emotional boundaries get in the way. The way you live your life. Some people just won't change. That's the way of life. Some people are destined to stay the same and so stuck in their ways. All the time you spend trying to change them is a waste. Cut them loose. Cut them loose so you can live bigger and bolder. Cut them loose so they no longer hold you back. Cut them loose so you can achieve your dreams. Stop carrying dead weight around. Surround yourself with success. Surround yourself with hustle. Surround yourself with passion. Surround yourself with people who lift you up, not pull you down. Surround yourself with who you want to be. Success is the hardest thing to achieve because we set where the finish line is. And if it means something to us, that line is far in the distance. You're not going to get there alone. No one ever did. It does not make you more successful to do it alone. It does not make you any better. Take the helping hand, listen to the people who did it before you, and understand that the more help you have, the better chances of success you will have. Build a team of people who are just as passionate about the things as you are. Take the risk or lose the chance. Opportunities do not present themselves every day. You must be prepared for when they come and then you must be willing to take a chance on it. But expecting that a lifetime of opportunities are going to happen every day is a loser's mentality. Thinking you will get another shot is a loser's mentality. Thinking you can choose to do this in a few years is a loser's mentality. You must understand that this shot you have right now could be the only one. Wouldn't you rather fail doing the thing you wish to do than pass on the opportunity and never find out at all? Breathe in and out. Take a breath. When the world around you seems to crumble, breathe. When hard times hit, breathe. When you fail, just breathe. Because when bad things happen, failure tries to suffocate us into submission, smother us into quitting. When it's not going to plan, we act on instinct, often make the wrong or bad decisions. But if we just take a moment and assess we can learn. Bad situations are actually good situations. You just don't know how to extract the good from the hard times. The lessons learned from success are good, but the lessons learned from failures are greater. Success is the sum of all your small efforts, repeated day in and day out. If you fail in enough time, you will succeed. It is that simple. If you give in to failure, you will never win. Fail your way to success. Learn to love the hard times. Learn to enjoy the lesson life has to offer you. The bigger the dream, the better. But do not get lost in it. Do not set a dream or a goal that deep down you do not believe you can achieve. The strongest have been the weakest. We all make mistakes. 
Me, you, people you see on the way to work, your boss, your colleagues, I guarantee that the one person you have always aspired to be has made mistakes. You have to be weak in order to have the desire, the urge to change, to grow, and eventually to become a better person. Remember, it's normal. It's normal to feel low or at your lowest. If right now you feel it's time to give up, to stop trying to succeed, don't leave it here. Take this day as the day to improve. Improve yourself, better yourself. Become the person you have always wanted to become. Be the person you wanted to become. Fear can stop you from trying. Months down the road, you're in the same position, wondering why you've not gotten any closer to your goals. But if you had just put your head down and taken it one step at a time, you would have been much closer to achieving your goals. Take action. Take action now. Take action now to finally improve your life. Can you do this? Think about the future. A future where you've grown into a person. A person you want to be. A day where you wake up appreciating the ground you walk on. Appreciating the food that nourishes you. Appreciating the people that care for you. Appreciating the water you drink. Grateful for the blood that flows through your veins. We all need this. Feel the desire to improve. To not be afraid to make mistakes. And love the journey that you're on. That time is now. Wake up and feel empowered to change, to not take a step back, but take a step forward. Take a step into a world where you are grateful for yourself, grateful for life, and grateful for making the mistakes that transformed you into the person you've always wanted to be. If you give it your all, if you push your limits, if you progress every day, is it possible for you? Earn your respect with hard work. Earn your respect with hustle. Earn your respect with substance. Earn your respect with the early wake-up calls. Earn your respect with late-night working. Earn your respect with keeping your word. Earn your respect. Don't expect respect. You must believe in yourself before you believe in a dream. You are capable of anything and everything once you believe in your own skills and abilities. Earn your respect with proving them wrong. Respect is earned, not given. Is it going to be hard? Yes, but the best things in life are. Take a moment and breathe. Take a moment and assess. Because if it is hard, it is usually worth doing. Each step you take is different. Sometimes just to move forward one simple step, you have to convince your spirit with your mind that in the end, it will be worth it. Nothing worth having comes easy. Nothing that comes easy is worth having. Choose the hard path. Choose to put yourself in a position to fail. Choose to enjoy losing. Anything that gives you an uncontrollable smile in the morning is worth fighting for. Choose to chase the situations that test you mentally and physically. Don't choose easy. If it were easy, everyone would be doing it. Anything you dream about is worth fighting for. Anything you want bad enough is worth fighting for. Fight for what you want in life. Don't wait and lose time, because sometimes later becomes never. In your mind, you will find success. Time is ticking. The clock is going always, constantly. Time is our most precious resource. Use it wisely. The timer is always going. It is always running. You cannot control time. It will only stop once for you. When you lay down in bed tonight, tell yourself, it is the ultimate equalizer. It is the reason you can go from living in the streets to billionaire. All the successful people in the world, if given the choice between more money or more time, would choose more time. It is possible for me. It is within my reach. No amount of money 
can be placed on the value of time. You wake up with the same hours that Jeff Bezos has, the equal opportunity Elon Musk has. We all have the same amount of hours in the day. Use that knowledge as power. Don't wait for tomorrow. Don't wait for another chance. Grasp it now. I am capable. I am deserving. The clock is still ticking when you're playing video games. The clock is still running when you are scrolling through Instagram. The time still ticks when you are out at the club or partying. Time is running. Time is going. You are not special. It will not stop for you. Unless your time is up. We all have to be aware that tomorrow may never come. It is something we don't like to think about, but one day tomorrow won't come. I have enough talent. I am powerful enough. When that day could happen, would you have achieved the goals you wanted to and spend time with the people who you should have? I will reach my goal. Or would you fall short of your goals? Would you have spent the time with the wrong people and missed out on the thing you should have done? When you are on your deathbed, will you rest easily knowing you gifted the world with your talents and skills? Or will you die with the dream you still locked away deep inside your mind where it will rest forever, never to see the light of day? Tell yourself these things because they are true. You can succeed. Never let fear decide your success. Don't let your dreams die with you. Gift them to the world and you will live forever. Because you've been weak, you can now be strong. Because you've been afraid, you can now be fearless. Because you've been foolish, you can now be wise. You can now be the person you actually want to become. Say this out loud. I am strong because I've been weak. I am fearless because I've been afraid. I am wise because I've been foolish.